tag-team match. On the way to the ring... This sold-out crowd is on its feet tonight here in St. Louis, Missouri. These fans are so excited, I'm having a hard time staying in my own seat myself. I'm with you on that, partner. We've got a great show here tonight for these St. Louis fans, and I can't wait oh. to get started. Uh. Great reversal! You feel like a jerk when someone counters you like that. He slipped out of that one. Watching these superstars go at it reminds me why I prefer to stay on this side of the announce table. You know, if you let me train you, you could be cruiserweight champ inside a year. Oh, no. I've heard stories about the way you train people. You make Marine drill instructors look like pushovers. Are you surprised? They're just training people to go to war. I train them to be WWE superstars. Well, thanks, but no thanks, partner. I think I'll stick to announcing for now. These superstars have been given it everything they've got all night. They sure have. And that's where the superb conditioning of the WWE superstars comes into play. Yeah, you're not going to win a match if you're blown up two minutes into it. You can say that again. I've seen matches won and lost simply because one superstar was able to outlast their opponent. Oh, man. These WWE fans are fired up. They sure are, and you know that's going to have an effect on this match. Yeah, that's just great. Why don't you just quit showing off and get down to business? He is getting down to business. He's in the sports entertainment business, isn't he? I don't think there's anything that Sabu wouldn't do to an opponent if he thought it would win him the match. Well, what did you expect? He comes from ECW, where the only rules are, there are no rules. You can show off for the crowd if you want, but all that does is let your opponent rest up. Actually, I think it's a great display of confidence on the part of this great superstar. I 
I don't think that chair is going to be good for much after this match. Well, it's good for what he's using it for, and that's all that matters. <laughs> and here's a little something for the fans. That's why they love him. Who cares what they think? All he's doing here is giving his opponent a chance to recover. This capacity crowd is making their opinions known tonight. Yeah, the WWE fans aren't known for keeping their opinions to themselves. Ugh. He anticipated that move perfectly. <laughs> Even if you wind up winning a match like this, you're going to be feeling it for the next week. Yes, but that's the case if you lose as well. And having to deal with emotional as well as physical pain is that much worse. Hey, it's pretty insightful for a guy who's never wrestled a match in his life. Well, I've been in the locker room after a match and seen the superstars who don't get their hands raised. You can literally feel the disappointment radiating off them. It's not a pretty sight. I certainly don't envy the referee in this match. No kidding. No matter what call you make, you're going to get on the bad side of at least one superstar. And that's about the last place you want to be if you're not a superstar yourself. Trust me, I know. No superstar in the locker room can afford to ignore the WWE fans. You're right about that. Without the fans, we'd all be out of a job. Sabu might be one of the most exciting and dangerous superstars on the ECW roster. Sabu's not a superstar. He's an extremist. He's a stuntman. He's a one-man train wreck. How do you approach a match with someone like the great Kali? Well, part of the problem is there aren't any guys like him. All you can do is just keep moving and don't let him get his hands on you. And I can only imagine that that's a lot easier said than done. He must take up at least a quarter of the ring as it is. I think these superstars are going to keep it up until they've got literally nothing left to give. And that's the attitude you have to take to win. You know that your opponent isn't going to hold anything back, and you can't afford to either. I'd love to know where you're coming up with this stuff, because it sure ain't from personal experience. These fans expected an extreme performance from Sabu, and I don't think they'll leave disappointed. Sabu makes me sick. He shows no respect for his own body. How can he possibly respect anyone else? I think Sabu respects anyone who's willing and able to go the distance with him. Well, I don't. A superstar's career is too valuable to risk it by getting in the ring with a head case like Sabu. I hate to admit it, but when I look at superstars like the great Kali, part of me is glad I'm not an active competitor. Are you seriously admitting that the great Kali intimidates you? There it is. Blood in the water. The end is near. How can you sound so excited? These are human beings in the ring, for God's sake. Correction, these are WWE superstars. And sometimes this is what it takes to win. Man, I don't want this match to end. I'm with you, partner. But it's got to end sooner or later. Well, whichever way it goes, no one can say that these superstars didn't give it everything they got. These... Look at that! That's going to go over big with the fans and build some momentum at the same time. You gotta watch out for your opponent when they're getting fired up like this. Come on, quit showing off. This is a wrestling match, not a popularity contest. We've seen this before. He's been wrestling his style of match, and he's coming up on a big payoff. Night after night, the WWE...